welcome back to the Mindfulness Moves Yoga channel. My name is Emma and today we are going to do yoga at the wall. So grab your mat, find a wall, and we'll get started. Come find a comfortable spot on your mat with your legs crossed and we'll start by just rolling at our neck, tilting our head down to the side, looking towards your stomach, other side, and back up. And again, opposite way, looking towards your stomach, over to the other side, and up. Again, and up, and other side. And back up. Now letting your head fall towards the right, Taking your right hand and just placing it onto the side of your head. Feeling a nice stretch through your neck here. Not adding too much pressure with your hand, but just placing it there. Dropping your left shoulder down. Good, lifting your hand back up. Let your head fall over to the left side. Bring your left hand over to your left ear, letting your right shoulder drop down. And again, not putting too much pressure on your head here, just lightly placing your hand. And then start to lift your head back up. We'll bring our right arm across our body now. I'm just taking your left hand, gently guiding your left hand along your right arm, giving it a stretch again, holding down, stretching out your shoulder blade here. One more. And then we'll just hold here for a couple of breaths. Feeling a nice stretch through your shoulder blades, stretching out your back. Good, and then letting that go. Bringing your left arm across. And again with your right hand, just gently guiding along your left arm. Feeling a stretch. One more time. And letting it stay there. Good, releasing that arm. And you'll come onto your knees by your wall. You're gonna take your right arm and stretch it out along the wall, letting your arm rest on the wall. As close as you can get your shoulder to the wall and you'll feel a nice stretch through your shoulder there, down your arm. You can keep your gaze forward in front of you. And then just backing off if that's too much. Letting that right arm go. And then just turning around and bringing your left arm onto the wall this time. Again, keeping your gaze forward, feeling a good stretch through your shoulder here. Dropping your belly, look up. Breathing out, rounding out your back, look down to your tummy. 
breathing in, drop your belly, look up. Breathing out, rounding out your back. And then allow your eyes to close down here. Move with your in breath and your out breath. Towards your thighs. And then start to walk your hands towards your feet. Separating your feet apart. And you'll start to feel yourself hit the wall here. Bending your knees, coming into a rag doll. And your forward folds here. Feeling a nice stretch through your hamstrings. You can shake out your head yes and no. Let it all go. Swing side to side. Release your hands. Bring your toes together. We'll rise all the way up here. Hands in towards your heart. And then we'll come down onto our knees, turning towards the wall. Bringing your bum as close to the wall as possible and then bringing your legs up. And we'll come into butterfly here, soles of your feet together. Your knees go wide. Bringing two hands on to your stomach. And just allowing your eyes to close down. Letting gravity do the work here. And then just surrendering into the pose, letting your thoughts settle. Letting your body settle into the pose. start to feel a bit uncomfortable, a big stretch, and then just using your breath to help your muscles, giving them oxygen. Thinking about sending your breath to a specific part of your body. If you're feeling a lot of tension or a sensation there, And then slowly you'll take your right leg out over to the side. 
her dragonfly pose. Keeping your toes on your right foot flexed. Hands can stay on your stomach if that's comfortable. Or if you feel like you need to place them somewhere else, go ahead and do that. Gently bringing your right leg back. Letting your left leg stretch out this time for dragonfly on the left. And just noticing now where you're starting to feel those sensations, if there are any coming up. And then remember to focus on your breathing in and out through your nose. with our knee and your left foot resting on the wall here if you'd like you can bring your hands in between your legs thread them through kind of like you're doing a thread the needle pose and then if you'd like using your right elbow to push out your right leg even more Getting a deeper stretch here. And then again, allowing your eyes to close. Letting your body rest into the pose. right foot on to the wall and then remembering to keep your left foot flexed here and then placing your hands where you'd like onto your stomach or threading them through your right leg 
using your left elbow here to press against your left leg, opening up even more. And then just noticing if this side is feeling different from your first side. There's more tension, less tension, more sensation, less sensation. I'm just noticing that. them just somewhere on your body. In this pose you might start to feel your feet tingling as the blood rushes faster back to your heart. This is a really great pose to do before you go to bed at night, promoting relaxation and rest. Continuing here to allow your mind to rest, your thoughts to quiet, and just focusing on your breathing in and out. giving them a squeeze and then letting them fall over to the left side bring your arms out into a T looking over to the right to the left. And then bring them back to center. 
And if you have time, setting up for Shavasana, moving yourself away from the wall, stretching your arms and legs out long, letting your eyes close, and just allowing yourself to stay there as long as you would like to. And if you don't have time for that today, that is okay. You can come sit up with your legs crossed, take a couple breaths, and then move along with your day. Thanks for joining me for today's Yoga at the Wall. I hope that you enjoyed yourself and you can practice some of these poses anytime, especially before you go to bed, promoting rest and relaxation. For more Mindfulness Moves Yoga, don't forget to subscribe and like and hit the notification bell to know whenever we're posting a new video. Thanks so much. We'll see you next time.